um, my name is Megan, this is Mike. We're both athletic training students at Seton Hall University and today we are going to be showing you different exercises for uh, scapular retraction and those exercises are going to be working your rhomboids major, minor, and your middle traps. So the first exercise we're going to be showing you is an isometric exercise and it's going to be horizontal abduction. Um, so for an isometric exercise you're not lengthening or um, shortening the muscle. So what I'm going to have Mike do is stand against the wall, heels against the wall, back against the wall. He's going to abduct his arm to 90 degrees and he's just going to be pushing his elbow into the wall. He's going to hold for 10 seconds and then rest for 10 seconds and then repeat that about five times. So the next exercise we're going to be showing you is an isotonic closed kinetic chain exercise. So for this he's going to be doing scapular push-ups. So I'm first going to instruct him to get in a quadruped position, so on his hands and knees. And essentially what he's going to be doing is he's going to be um, retracting his scaps, so go ahead, which is essentially just them coming together. And then he's going to hold it there for five seconds, and then he's going to release, protracting. Um, he's going to do three sets of ten. And to make this harder, he can go up into a plank position, and then do that again. And then to make it even harder from there, he can put his hands on either a BOSU ball or a foam pad. So the next exercise we're going to be doing is an isotonic open kinetic chain. So for this one, I'm going to have Mike do some rows. So he's going to start out, he, since we don't have a bench or a table available to us, he's going to go down on his knee. But if you do have a bench or a table, you can definitely use that. So what I'm going to instruct him to do is start with his arm straight out and then he's going to flex his elbow and retract his scapula. So if you were to come back here, you would see this scap coming closer to the other one. And then he's just going to repeat that, three sets of ten, and if you want to make this harder, you can add a heavier weight. So the last exercise we're going to be showing you is a functional exercise. This one's especially good for overhead athletes. So we have a resistance band tied in a knot and placed in a doorway. So what I'm going to instruct Mike to do is put his hand through the band and then bring his arm into 90 degrees abduction and 90 degrees external rotation. And he's, what he's going to do is he's just going to bring his arm back, retracting the scaps, and then he's going to perform three sets of ten. And then to make this harder, you can change the resistance band and make it heavier.